Hi everybody, this is Philippe. Welcome to Concert Classical Guitars here in Paris. And today um, we're going to show you a very fine guitar, one of the finest guitar for concert players. And this guitar is um, made by Paul Sheridan in Australia. Um, uh, this guitar is a uh, lattice brace guitar, of course. This is a heavyweight guitar. Um, <clears throat> Paul Sheridan has its own design. There's uh, very few carbon uh, reinforcement to the bracing, so the sound is very natural, but it has its own uh, voice. Uh, this guitar has a cedar top, a peduc bridge, which is very lightweight, so the top is very light on this guitar. Uh, it has a very nice here, uh, very nicely carved um, armrest, uh, so you won't touch the top. Uh, Tasmanian uh, Tiger Milton Wood for the back and side. It's uh, very sexy looking. Uh, The white wood that is used for the neck is um, is oak, and uh, you have uh, Sloan tuners here, and ebony fretboard, and you can see that this guitar has a um, slightly elevated neck, and the shape of the top goes down like this, and you have two very small uh, ported holes which are not sound hole uh, and um, just help the guitar to have more air entering in the guitar and have pushing more air so uh, this guitar is uh, gorgeous and sexy um, black wood uh, for the for the bindings very smooth very nice um, the top is not a gloss finish it's a satin finish let's check the sound of this guitar um, by the way the, the setup is pretty low very easy and there's i have to mention that it's a 64 scale length on this guitar so there is not too much tension on the strings just enough to make to feel comfortable and um, just make you want to how come that guitar can be so easy? It's just 64. So it just change a little bit. On that guitar, we have um, uh, carbon strings. Um, the nut is a little wider than usual, maybe one millimeter more. Usually it's a uh, 51 and this one is 52. So you have just a little more room or more space for the fingers. So you it compensate the fact that uh, there's uh, less length with the wider, a little bit wider neck, but it doesn't bother. I have not too big hands and I'm, I'm not troubled a lot. So let's check the sound for the basses. As usually, as usual with the the lattice brace Australian guitar, you have a very long, very long notes, very long sustain. D string still pretty, pretty, pretty warm. When you play on those guitar, you have you have to be very careful because there's a lot of overtone coming so you can all let them ring or cut some frequencies
but still the notes is here. So it's your, as your taste. G string. It's a very open sounding with the uh, very medium pronounced. So you have um, uh, in front of the mix, I mean, uh, the, the, the medium on those guitar are very focused and present. So they help to have a very big sound in, in big uh, concert halls. But on this guitar, the fact that there is almost no carbon to the bracing, the sound is pretty natural. <laughs> string still very medium with vibrato or vi without Very silky, very, very round, and the first string. Very, very, very strong. Very nice C. The X to C is very pretty long. Usually they are very short on this guitar. No. Um, as you can hear, there's uh, the, the 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 overall sound is uh, towards the medium and medium bass. It's not overly bright, but this helps the guitar the guitar to to push the sound very far and. Um, there's a lot of uh, the sound is like on the piano is very surrounding all, all, all over the place. I play with the basses. There's a lot of pleasure playing this guitar. If I play with the in the trebles.
can say to you guys is uh, there's a long waiting list to get a guitar like this and this guitar is one of a kind um, you don't meet everyday guitar like this and um, this is the sound is as sexy as the back of this guitar I mean it's as good as it gets and um, if you're looking for a very cool guitar with a beautiful sound and you have to play in deep places this is the guitar you have to play thank you for watching